Hi guys and welcome back to my channel. Oh boy. So let's address the elephant in the room. I have not uploaded in a long time and I just wanted to talk to you guys about why that is and about what I have been up to because um, I've been up to a lot. I just haven't been posting on this channel, but I just, I've been obsessing about, you know, how do I come back? Now it's awkward. I've been gone so long. I'm not really sure, you know, what direction I want to take with this channel. And I've been really thinking about it and, um, I've, I've missed YouTube. I really have. And I think I just need to stop worrying so much and stop, uh, overthinking you know, like feeling like, oh, it has to be perfect or I have to wait until I have this set up or what, like, who cares? Um, I just want to, I just want to make videos again. And so let me just get you guys kind of caught up on what's been going on. So since my last upload, I actually have gone through a uh, name change or like a uh, rebranding of sorts which doesn't change much for you as a viewer, but I just wanted to kind of explain that. So I used to be planning with Cass and I switched over to Cassie Makes Art. And there's a few reasons for that. Um, I did talk about it on my podcast, Shameless Plug, to the Pixels and Planners podcast. Um, the new episode of that will be going up soon, but the Patreon exclusive episode went up last week. So if you're interested in supporting me further and getting an exclusive podcast episode uh, every month on Patreon or in joining my sticker club on Patreon where you will get stickers in the mail every month, uh, be sure to go to patreon.com slash Cassie Makes Art and I will have that link in the description as well. I truly appreciate your support. Um, but I really went through a whole kind of rebranding because it's kind of me forcing myself to create. Uh, it kind of holds me accountable to do more than uh, just take, you know, play with stickers in my planner. And there's nothing wrong with playing with stickers in your planner, but I have been creating so much stuff and I'm so passionate about it. And it's so easy to let life get in the way and to just give up on your dreams and give up on your passions and things you want to do. And so, um, Changing it from playing with Cass to Cassie Makes Art was kind of my way of saying, look, I need to stop discounting myself. I need to stop saying, oh, I'm not an artist. I'm not good enough to be called an artist. I'm an artist. I am a writer, a photographer, an illustrator, a designer, a podcaster, a sticker maker. I'm an artist. And I'm working every day to um, kind of convince myself of that and to keep creating. And so um, kind of where this channel is going to go, I'm going to be honest with you, I don't really know. I, I'm just going to be perfectly honest. And that's why I haven't come back is because I, I haven't quite figured out what kind of content I want to create here. But I know I want to do more videos on like my process of, um, you know, drawing certain things and then making stickers and uh, packing orders for my shop, uh, which you can check out at etsy.com slash Cassie Makes Art. If you're interested in shopping my stickers and stationery, I do have new products uh, that I am working on, so please stay tuned. You can also go to CassieMakesArt.com and sign up for my newsletter, uh, which there is a link um, on my Etsy shop to that, but if you just go to CassieMakesArt.com, I'll have all this in the description box, you can sign up for a newsletter so you'll be the first to know about new products and announcements and sales and things like that. Um, I really am trying not to get discouraged. I'm really trying to just keep going um, and just not let myself kind of fall into just day to day, you know, working my nine to five, just getting through life. Like I, I see a certain life for myself and I'm not going to stop until I get that. And so I appreciate everyone who supports me, whether it is uh, through Patreon, through shopping, you know, on Etsy with me, or if it's through following me and commenting on stuff, all that free stuff is very, very important. And I'm trying to create more on TikTok. I got a little discouraged because I just, I don't even get as many views on TikTok as I do on Instagram, but I'm trying to stop worrying about the numbers and uh, just keep creating because I want to. And eventually you know, the right person will see it 
And um, I just, I'm really just pushing myself to keep going. And so my biggest goal right now is to continue growing my Etsy shop. I just launched in November of 2021. I've not been open very long. So I'm trying to give myself grace with that. And I am, um, you know, I do work a full-time job and I also currently have a part-time job as well. And so I, you know, it's very, it's very hard to, you know, after a long day of work, come home and sit down and sit at the computer again and work on designing and work on Etsy, you know, SEO stuff. And it's difficult, but it's what I want to do. So I'm motivated to do that. I want to be a full-time content creator and Etsy shop owner. That's what I want to do. I want to go to craft fairs. I want to go to game conventions and sell, you know, like pop culture related stickers and and notebooks and just all that stationary stuff. I I really want to do this. And people might think it's cringe and people might be laughing at me and they might think, oh, she's not good enough to ever do that. And that, you can think that all you want. I believe in myself. My husband believes in me. And every single time I get an order on my Etsy shop, it reaffirms that, you know, somebody likes what I'm doing and I, I just need to keep going. And um, I'm very new at this whole art thing. I've always had an interest in it. And I just got into digital art last year. And so my art is kind of a combination of traditional and digital art. And I'm still learning exactly what my niche is with my Etsy shop. I, I really wasn't ready to launch it. And I just said, you're never going to be ready. Just launch it. You know, as far as like getting my logo ready and figuring out like, what's my tagline and like, what, how do I describe what my shop is? Because I'm, I don't want to put myself in a box because I had thought about saying, you know, oh, creepy, but cute designs, but it's not all going to be that. So I, it's very difficult. Um, so right now I'm just, you know, these, these designs and these stickers on my shop are really just inspired by things that I love and things that mean a lot to me. And it's based around, you know, uh, bands I like and mental health and uh, video games and just things that mean a lot to me. And so in the future, Maybe it just ends up being pop culture stuff. Um, the pop culture mental health stuff does really well in my shop. So, I um, mean, that's what I really love doing. So we'll just kind of see where it goes. I've been making more planner stickers. I make a lot of die cut stickers and uh, I just want to kind of keep going. And um, I'm still using my planners. I'm using my planners a lot and I'm using my planners so much that I haven't really shown you guys uh, my planners. I've been uh, very, very busy and I'm actually uh, switching jobs right now, which is a very stressful and um, emotional and time consuming thing. Um, but my current planner system has really been working for me and I want to show you guys that more. I want to explain to you, you know, how I'm using each planner and how that has evolved and just show you how I'm still able to be creative with my planners and make them work for me. And also that some days, especially with daily planning, I don't have time to be creative. I don't have time to do a spread. I just have to put a pen down on the paper. Um, but with my catch all planner, I really decorating it is very therapeutic for me. And it's what keeps me, you know, coming back to it. So I am going to have a video on that. I want to show you guys my catch-all. I haven't shown you in a while what it looks like. It looks a lot different than the last time you saw it. And I actually have some new inserts from Savannah Paper Co. that I really am excited to share with you guys. Because this paper, honey, is... It is a godsend. It's like cardstock paper. Um, it's incredible. I'm obsessed with it. And I also still have my blackout inserts from the Lights Planner Action. So... It's all really working for me and my Passion Planner Daily has been honestly a game changer for me and I just want to talk to you guys about that. So um, if you have been wondering where I have been, um, you know, please follow me on, on Instagram. Um, I'm going to put links to everything in the, in the description, like I said, but it's at Cassie.makes.art. Um, someone has Cassie Makes Art without the dots and they're not even active. 
I did reach out to them in DMs, but I haven't heard anything, so it's kind of frustrating, but it is what it is. And then um, my shop account is shop.castingmakesart, and I really just wanted to have a separate account to feature my products and things like that. Um, and then TikTok, I'm Cassie Makes Art. My podcast, Pixels and Planners Podcast, um, I put a new episode up. I try to do every two weeks. I'm in a little bit delayed, but like I said, the Patreon episode did go up, and I thought it was a pretty good episode. Um, and then you also get a, a shop, a discount with my shop by uh, becoming a patron. So my lowest tier is $3 a month, so that's pretty affordable for most people. But if you're not interested in supporting me in that way, that is totally fine. I'm not trying to pressure anybody. I just want to share it. People keep telling me you need to promote it more because how do people know that it exists if you don't talk about it? It's just kind of a weird thing. But I am so grateful for my patrons. I will have a list um, of all of their names at the end of this video. I give them a shout out in every video I upload. Um, and I just try to share like behind the scenes things on Patreon. Again, it's an exclusive podcast episode every month. Um, a sticker club where you get stickers in the mail automatically every month. So if you're somebody who doesn't feel like fooling around with ordering from shops and stuff, and you just want to get some happy mail every month, um, I really enjoy that benefit. And I enjoy seeing, you know, getting messages from my patrons and say, oh my gosh, I love the stickers this month. Uh, it makes me very happy. So I appreciate you guys so much. Again, I apologize for not uploading for so long. I just was feeling a little burnout with YouTube and a little discouraged by my low views, but I'm really trying to uh, move past that and just upload because I love doing it, which is why I started in the first place. And I will do Plan With Me's occasionally. Um, I will do, you know, Q&A's and I'll do, you know, more like tutorials on how to make stickers and uh, just show you like my process of making art and stuff like that. I just, uh, I really need to just get my butt in gear and create some stuff. It's just been crazy lately, but I have been creating stuff um, for Instagram and TikTok and for my Etsy shop and for my podcast. So I, I haven't been just doing nothing. I just haven't uploaded here. So I appreciate you guys who are still subscribed after all this time. I still get new subscribers and I thank you because you, you probably look at my channel and you're like, wow, she hasn't uploaded in a long time, um, but you're still subscribing and I really appreciate that. So I hope you guys enjoyed this this video and this little update, and uh, I look forward to creating more content here on YouTube. And so, um, I appreciate you guys so much. I hope that you've been doing well. Let me know in the comments. Um, just how how have you been? Like, how have you been doing? Honestly, like truthfully, how are you? Um, and it's okay to say that you're not okay. May is Mental Health Awareness Month. I'm very passionate about that. I do have an episode of the podcast coming out that is all about that. I talk about mental health on pretty much every episode though. It is something that's very important to me and I um, I do share a lot about it on every episode, but especially on the Patreon uh, exclusive episodes as well. So um, yeah, just let me know how you're doing and um, what you got going on and how 2022 has been for you so far. Uh, for me, it has really been a whirlwind, but good overall. So I hope you guys are doing well. I've missed you. I've missed creating videos and I plan to upload a lot more. So uh, be sure to give this video a thumbs up if you enjoyed it. Subscribe if you have not. And I'll see you next time. Bye.